Hey, what's up friends, family, and everybody else? So today I have two Fusion Strike ETBs that I'm gonna be comparing against one another, but one of them is the Pokemon Center ETB for Fusion Strike, and then the other one is the regular, you know, retail store uh, ETB right here. So we got the blue one versus the purple and pink one. Um, so let's go ahead and just start ripping. I'm gonna start with the, the Pokemon Center one just because I haven't opened one of these before. So it's a little bit uh, more exciting for me. I think they're basically the same, except for the fact that the, um, the Pokemon Center one's gonna have two more booster packs. Uh, let me get a knife over here. Yeah, so it should have two more booster packs than the regular one, uh, which is why it's also $10 more expensive. But I like to get these just because I think it's kind of cool seeing the difference in the box, the artwork and stuff. So uh, they're pretty sweet looking. Let's go ahead and just get this thing torn open, throwing the trash aside. And there we have it. Here is the player's guide, which I think is actually exactly the same. And everything else looks like it's going to be exactly the same, actually, aside from how many packs are in there. Okay. So let's see. We got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten booster packs. And then everything else is basically the same. Um, oh, I think. I'm not sure if these are different than the one that comes in the regular booster packs. Yep, these are different, so at least the sleeves are different. Uh, this is from a normal ETB, and this is the Pokemon Center one, of course. And then we got the dividers. Wait a second. Did it come with two sleeves? Did I just... Right? Yeah, it comes with more sleeves than the other ones, I guess. Okay, interesting. Uh, here's the code card for you. And setting that aside and let's just rip open some booster packs. I think we're gonna save Mew for last again. And you know, that's my my chase card is Mew. Any of the Mews really I'd be happy with. All right, so first booster pack for today and we have the Gengar artwork right here. Come on, Gengar, give me something nice. Let's see what Gengar has for us. So here's the first code card. One, two, three, four. Okay, so there's our energy. Uh, Copra, or Copperja, not sure how to say that one, Zoroark, uh, Semipor, Drillbur, Shinx, Bunnery, uh, Basculin, Grubbin, oh, and look, check that out, it's actually one of those uh, knitted Pokemon, Helioptile, and we got a Huntail, rare non-hollow. Non okay, next booster pack, we got Bolton. We got a Shinx right there. Okay, here's the next code. One, two, three, four. So there's our energy. Swadloon, Cramomatic, Skaters Park, Shinx, of course, Bunnery, Basculin, Rubbin again, Mankey, Reverse Hollow Trevenant, and we got a Galarian Chrysola. Okay, nothing too crazy there. Although I actually did get some of the common cards that I didn't have yet, so that's pretty cool. Right, there's your next code card. One, two, three, four. Let's see what we got. So we have our Fire Energy, Spongy Gloves, Corvus Squire, Sand Slash, Tanamo, Zorua, Shelter, Caterpie, Drillbur, Reverse Hollow Persian, and we got a Claydol. All right, next up, another Gengar artwork. I would love to pull one of those Gengar alternate arts. Uh, either the V or the V Max. I think they both look pretty sweet, honestly. Um, but we'll see how lucky we get. I know I do have a booster box coming. It's actually supposed to be delivered today, so I might end up doing another opening today. Uh, we'll see. We'll see if that happens. One, two, three, four. Okay, so there's your Energy, Togedomaru, Schoolboy Trainer, Turtonator, Stuffle, Sig Sigalith, uh, Toxel. Totodile, Bunnery, Reverse Hollow Marshtop, and we got a Swampert. Okay, so this is the first hit from that ETB and for today. It is a Hollow Rare right there. Uh, hopefully we'll have some, some bigger hits coming up. We'll see. Come on. Where are you, Mew? Be happy with any of the Mews. There's your code card. One, two, three, four. So we have our Energy, Simiseer, Sligu, uh, Clawitzer, yeah, Clawitzer, Sigalith, Toxel, Totodile, Bunnery, 
Clombopus, Reverse Hollow Makuhita, and we got an Absol. Okay, you know, I always forget what this Pokemon is, but it's like Genesect, I think, or something like that. Ends with Sect, I'm pretty sure. But I can never quite remember the name. Okay, next code card. One, two, three, four. So we have our Energy, Phalanx, Togedemaru, uh, Cross Receiver, Zigzagoon, Mankey, Clauncher, Growlithe, Stuffle, Aracuda Reverse Hollow, and we got a Genghis Khan, or Genghis Khan. All right, another Gengar artwork booster pack. Come on, Gengar. Oh, we got a mining right there. That's cool. There's the code. One, two, three, four. So there's our energy, our trainer card, Kapraja, Zorark, Minan, of course, Baltoy, uh, Galarian Corsola, Quillfish, Volpix, Reverse Hollow Chansey, and an Excelagor. Okay, so we got three booster packs left from this uh, Pokemon Center ETB, and they are all the Mew booster packs, or the Mew artwork booster packs. And hopefully we'll pull a Mew from them. Okay, there's your code. One, two, three, four. So there's our energy. Uh, Piyukumuku, Schoolgirl, a trainer card, Clavapus, Tynamo, Zorua, Shelter, Caterpie, Reverse Hollow Bug Catcher, and we got a Greninja V. All right, nice. Our first V card for today. Pretty sweet looking one. I know Gre Greninja happens to be like a fan favorite. I'm not the biggest fan of Greninja, but this card does look pretty cool. I like all the blue in there. Gonna keep Greninja out. Oh, let me straighten Greninja right there. There you go. And next up, another Mew artwork booster pack. Okay, there's the code. One, two, three, four. So we have our Fire Energy, Persian, Power Tablet, Galarian Darmantian or Darmanitan, Sandigast, Vulpix, Melton, Toxel, Staryu, Reverse Hollow Growlithe, and we got a Toxtricity, another Hollow Rare right there. Pretty sweet looking. And here we have it, the last booster pack for today. I mean, not for today, the last booster pack from this ETV. <laughs> we still got another ETV to go with and another eight booster packs after this one, so. I don't know what I was thinking. Okay. Here we go. There's the code card. One, two, three, four. So we have our Energy, Simipore, Metapod, Battle VIP Pass, Chansey, Galarian Zigzagoon, Mankey, Clauncher, Growlithe, uh, Rockwinid, Reverse Hollow, and a uh, Gorbis or Gorbis. And that is it from the Pokemon Center ETV. So nothing too crazy from there, really. We did get this nice looking Greninja and a couple of Hollows, uh, but yeah, nothing too crazy. So let's just go ahead and move on to our regular ETV, which this one, our regular retail ETV, I got from, uh, where did I get it from? Oh, I got it from uh, GameStop and it was just delivered. So figured we'd get it ripped. So, yep, same exact player's guide, looks exactly the same. Even the box looks exactly the same, aside from that outside sleeve. Let's take this out. But yeah, this one only has one set of these uh, sleeves right here, while, while the Pokemon Center one had two sets of sleeves. And they're both different from this one, which is pretty interesting. And then here are eight booster packs. And actually, let's go ahead and just look at all these, yeah. So here are the two that came from the Pokemon Center ETV, and then this is the one that came from the regular retail ETV, and I don't know, which one's your favorite? I think that this Mew one right here is my favorite, and uh, my dog seems to be voicing his opinion. <laughs> uh, but yeah, definitely this one is my favorite of all of them. Pretty cool looking. Okay, set these aside and move on to our booster packs from our GameStop ETV, and I'm gonna do the same thing again, save these Mew ones for last, and then we'll move on and, and save Gengar for second to last. And let's start ripping these. Okay, come on, Bolton, give us something nice. There's the code card. 
One, two, three, four. So we have energy. Lapras, nice. Trainer school boy. Trainer, I don't like saying this one because it's too many names right there that start with C. Qfant, uh, Impidimp, Snum, Onyx, Jigglypuff, uh, Vicavolt Reverse Hollow, and a Corviknight. Okay, next booster pack. There's the code. One, two, three, four. So we have Energy, Dancer, Pangaro, Dra or Graplocked, Shinx, Bunnery, Baskelin, Grubbin, Mankey, Reverse Hollow, Galarian Meowth, and we got a Gudra. Nothing wild in that booster pack, but we got another Bolton artwork wish back. Come on, Bolton. You gotta have something nice for us in here. There's the code card. One, two, three, four. Alright, so there's Energy, Delketty, Dark Ray, uh, Crocona, Toxel, Totodile, Bunnery, Clobopus, Tynamo, Mudkip Reverse Hollow, and we got a Zerora. Apparently, Indiana is not a fan of Mudkip. There's the code. One, two, three, four. Where are you, Mew? Come on. There's our fighting energy. Stansler. I don't think I've pulled this card yet. It looks pretty cool. He's in a majestic looking pose right there. Gliscor, Sentascorch, Tanamo, of course. Galarian Meowth, Gossifleur, Panpour, Eevee, a reverse holo Klefki, and we got a training court gold card. Nice. Okay. First major hit for today, and it is a gorgeous looking gold card. Honestly, I prefer pulling uh, Pokemon uh, gold cards, but this one's pretty sweet looking. And honestly, it's one of my favorite like non-Pokemon gold cards. I think honestly my favorite non-Pokemon gold card is, I think it's from Evolving Skies and it looks, I don't remember what it's called, but it looks like the Misty Mountains from uh, Lord of the Rings. Uh, that's what I always think of when I see that card. But yeah, here we got a nice, my first gold card from this set, Training Court right there. Pretty cool looking, let's keep that out. And we still have, I think like three more booster packs? Yeah, three more. So let's see if we could get any other nice hits out of here. Uh, but so far, yeah, this uh, this ETB from GameStop is definitely winning as far as having the better hits. There's the code card. One, two, three, four. So we have our Fire Energy, Diggersby, Sydney Trainer, Cross Switcher Trainer, Groganunk, or Krogunk, Panseer, Gumi, Aracuda, Snubble, uh, Reverse Hollow Clamp Pearl, and a Hollow Steelix. Nice. Okay, there's the code. One, two, three, four. So, first off, we got Fire Energy, Copperaja, Cook. Uh, Mag Cargo, Shelmet, Plusel, Mana, Meowth, uh, Meryl, Reverse Hollow Starmie, and we got a Vicavolt. I actually think that's my first time pulling the Starmie. At least if I've pulled it, I, I don't remember pulling it. But. Anyway, Starmie is pretty cool. So is Staryu. Oh, I just got a little sneak peek. It looks like we got some sort of hit here, so we're going to see. Probably a V card, um, but... Who knows? Okay, so we have our Energy, Bug Catcher, Fusion Strike Energy, Turtonator, Shinx, Shelmet, Drillbur, Bunnelby, Mudkip, we have a Plusel, Reverse Hollow, and let's take a little peek. Okay, yep, 79 out of 264. Oh, Inteleon VMAX, awesome. Crazy looking card, honestly. Look at all that stuff going on in the background. Looks like he's just chilling in the cosmos. There we got Inteleon VMAX right there. Okay, yeah, definitely this regular non-Pokemon Center ETB is winning the day. <laughs> One more booster pack left. And it is another Mew artwork. Okay, there's the last code card for today. One, two, three, four. And let's see if we got anything in here. So we have our Energy, Alessa Sparkle, Beware, Skaters Park, Zorua, Shelter, Caterpie, Drillbur, Shinx, a Reverse Hollow Trainer Schoolgirl, and we got an Evil Toll. 
nothing crazy there. So yeah, honestly, we did pretty well today, but our, our regular retail ETB definitely did better for us than the um, Pokemon Center ETB, which is a little bit surprising just because uh, there's 10 booster packs in that one, so it should have a better chance of getting more hits, or um, not necessarily not necessarily better ones, but definitely more. And obviously, this other ETB from GameStop did better for us today. Biggest hit for today is definitely this gorgeous looking gold card, this uh, training court right there. I also really do like the Inteleon VMAX. Not one of my favorite Pokemon, but I know there's a lot of people who are big fans of Inteleon. So nice looking card. And then of course we got the regular Greninja V right there. And that's it. That's all I got for today. Like I said earlier, I do have a booster box coming pretty soon. Uh, shipped to me from Danny Phantom actually. So hopefully I'll be able to rip that soon and get some nice hits out of there too and start filling up that Fusion Strike binder. So that's it. That's all I got. So until next time, you guys have a wonderful day. Thanks. Bye.